I gave a lot of thought into what I wanted to say in response to Marcus's comments. At first I was pissed, then I was angry, and then finally I was just confused. I mean, it would be easy for me to rant and rave and to go off, and some would probably say that I have the right to do that. But me personally, I, I think that would serve no purpose. He has his opinion, and I have mine. And in this country, we still have that right. We can still have differences of opinions, and we can have discussions, and we can debate. Men and women have died to allow us to continue to have that right. If you want to say that you think that we're and are misguided, you have that right as well. Although I wonder if, if we could talk to some Holocaust survivors right now. I wonder if they would think that I was misguided. Now, as policy or people in power sometimes misguided, you know what? I would say yes without a doubt. But make no mistake, evil exists in this world. We see it every day. Some of it comes from tyrants, and some of it comes from our own neighbors. Who will stand in their way? Who will say enough? Who will help those who cannot help themselves? Who will allow themselves the decisions that they make to be judged by history? Those are questions that, that I am grateful, very grateful, that I no longer have to answer. And honestly, I pray Pray that no, I pray that someday that no one has to make those decisions. To this day, when I close my eyes, I can still see things. It, and it's not because I'm haunted by these images. It's a, because I don't want to forget. I don't want to forget how precious life is and how lucky that we are that except for Pearl Harbor on September 11th that we have not been attacked on our home soil in recent memory. We have not had our cities bombed, our homes occupied, our freedom to disagree taken from us. I'm glad that we live in a place where we can have differences of opinions and beliefs. And if tomorrow that freedom were being threatened, I would take up arms to defend your right not to honor me. Because I honor you and your rights.